ladies, and today we are going to be cooking our famous Yorkshire puddings. So the ingredients that you'll need to make Yorkshires is plain flour, 100 grams, 150 millilitres of milk, two eggs, and of course, the most important part, as far as I'm concerned, beef dripping. Let's get cooking. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Right, boo, we need to sift the flour and wear it out. Will you get the sift? Got it. Right, I always have a spoon that I keep in the flour. Always very useful. Um, and then I never get this flour mucky. Why would it be mucky? Well, you know, when you, um, if you, if you reuse a spoon for anything else, like if you get any fat in the flour, that'd be gross, right? Mm. Just use a clean spoon. But boo, you know it's always in just there. You've never use a clean spoon. But you've never complained. I just thought you'd forget about it. 13 years you've had that in the flour and you've never said anything about it. How much is it? 100. More. <laughs> it's 101! It doesn't matter because it's awesome. Right. Okay. right, just sieving the flour. I'd actually do it from a height. Oh my god. I think, I don't know why, but I think if you get air in it, the more air, the better. Well, you lose also flour well, if you do it from It's lucky you had that extra one, one gram then, isn't it? I'm losing more than a gram. Well, hold it closer. <laughs> Stop it! Nothing. <laughs> what are you? <laughs> Please tell me what. You just got a lot of white stuff. Leave me alone! Just. No. Look, Crip. Look. Yeah, don't do that! <laughs> oh, what have you got on your head? A flower! <laughs> no! No! What is it? Yeah. <laughs> Turn around to the camera. Turn around to the camera. <laughs> Stop it! What are you doing? Oh. Oh. Come on, let's get going. The, no, you let's can't. Let's get going. You can't just highlight that and no, not give an explanation. Get going. Let's get going. I don't have gross, greasy hair. I went no, for a massage. No, it's flour. I went for a massage this morning with my mum and I put some of that dry shampoo in because like some of the oils got in my hair and it looked like I didn't wash my hair. Does it, it look awful? <laughs> you might have to wash your hands now. Come on. Um, I'm just going to measure out 150 millilitres of milk. I just love the old school nature of a glass bottle. 150 millilitres. Is that 150, babe? Yep. Exactly. Why are you putting more on? Because I think it's the bubbles that you're seeing there. Okay. That's the line, right? Yeah. Well, well, that's over now. Today, I have got away with uh, my hand whisking because really, to get the best rise, you'll need a proper one. I don't think that's got anything to do with the rise. It's just a proper good old mix, and yes. I like doing it in that. But the point is, I don't have to do it today. Right. No, 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 that's wrong. <laughs> the milk goes you in You just that. told me to put it in I, there. I told you to put it in there. I've never seen you put it in this, by the way. That's because you never see me doing it. I do see you doing it. Two eggs, please. I always put an extra egg in. The fresher the eggs, the higher the rise. Two. One in. Pinch of salt. The fresher the eggs, the better. That was a good drop. We've got the oven here on 200 degrees Celsius, preheated to get the rise in the Yorkshire pudding. You can spoon it in. Right. Spoon what in? The flour. Right, woman. Right. Right, spoon it in the bit. Keep it going, go on. Yep. We're doing it gradually so that we prevent lumps in the mixture. Carry on, boo. Move your hand. Move it, move it. There you go. We're going to put some dripping into each one of these. So Eleanor has decided, because we've got a lot of leftover fat from various things, she's going to use some old fat. And this has probably That's been... new. Shh. It's probably been really recycled three times, I'd say. Who's counting? Why do you use old fat? Because... Recycling. Yeah, because there's nothing wrong with it. It's a bit like... Our commitment to being green. <laughs> <laughs> what in fact content? <laughs> Why is it that all our episodes there is some sort of mass fat usage? 
Because that's what we like to cook with. Maybe we should be doing healthier options. It's the equivalent of a teaspoon of dripping, so that when it's melted, it actually covers the whole of the bottom of the pot. Reusing the dripping is not wasteful, and it's better for the environment. (laughs) I can't say that straight. (laughs) Right, so we need to get this in the oven at a really high temperature, and we don't put the mix in now. We do that when it's boiling hot and melted. I'm gonna put it in the oven. How long do we put it up for? Top rack. It's on the top rack. Yeah, yeah. When it's smoking, the fat, it's ready. We'll check in five minutes. Alexa, set the timer for five minutes. No, you need to go, Alexa, (laughs) set the timer for five minutes. (laughs) Alexa, off. Alexa, cancel all timers. (laughs) Alexa, pays attention to me and not to Steph. Always, it's my Alexa. Yeah, I know we are. It's my account, but it always says, Good afternoon, Eleanor. Alexa, set the timer for five minutes. Five minutes, starting now. When do we have Yorkshire puddings? Well, we only ever have Yorkshire puddings with roast beef. Alexa, Alexa off! <laughs> <laughs> Why did you shout? That was so loud. We only ever have Yorkshire puddings with roast beef. So Our kids would like Yorkshire puddings on most dishes Shh. Alexa off off Alexa off Alexa Alexa off <laughs> she'll listen to me Alexa, Alexa off <laughs> Alexa off right she doesn't listen to you she only listens she to, me. Listen to me it's because you shout at her and she only greets you she doesn't greet me no she said good afternoon Eleanor Boo, do you have an inferiority complex with Alexa? <laughs> and it's my account. <laughs> Let's go. Come on. In order to keep the fat hot, when we take it out of the oven, we put it onto the lit gas hobs. Mind your backs. Whew, you see the smoke? That's when it's ready. You ready, Smiles? Yep. We'll keep it on. When you can hear that sizzle, it's the right temperature. You can already see from the edges that it's starting to cook. Let's go. Be careful. I know. Black. You're very full, Eleanor. Right, how long? 15 to 20 minutes. Crib on me. What happens is you can be very tempted at this stage to open up the oven. That will make the Yorkies actually flop down in size and it's, the rise will go. So only take them out when you're absolutely confident that they are done. Check those out. Oh. Woohoo! Amazing. Yeah, they're brilliant. They're doing really well. So just plug them in here. Wow, that's so really nice. Yeah. They're crisp on the outside. They've still got the slight goo. The rise and, is there. And what our kids love most is basically getting one like that and then pouring the gravy in the middle. <laughs> mm. Oh wow! That's really good. <laughs> Mm. And that gravy you made last night is delicious. Ellen is even having it with um, lemon and sugar. I love it with lemon and sugar, it's just like pancakes. Thanks for watching. Oh, like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Bye. Bye. Very good with lemon. Oh, I prefer gravy. Do you want to try it? No. <laughs>